News, Kansas News Leader. Fridays are always fun because we get to meet a new friend from Helping Hands Humane Society. Emmy is here with the introduction. Hi, yes. Emmy. Hello. And happy belated birthday, everybody. Yesterday was Emmy's yes, birthday. So we're excited to see you here as always. Yes. This little guy is excited too. Who is this? This is Chaz. He's a very good boy. He does no sit. I got one treat. Will you sit for it? Good boy. And he loves to have his little stuffed animal in his mouth. He walks around most of the time at the shelter with his stuffy looky. Like, oh, no, now he's into exciting. the treats. Now he's into the treats. He's so about, what do we know about him? How old is he? How long has he been at the shelter? We think he's go. about four years old. Come he's on been back, with Jeff. us since January 2nd, so that's about 80 days now. So quite a while. We've gotten to know, you know, what he likes and dislikes. And he, he's just a fun kind of middle-aged dog, so not too much energy, but he does like to romp around and play a little bit. And he's just a sweet guy. And he's very good because he's not wanting to climb right onto the couch. Yeah. You you could, so Chaz. I would let you because <laughs> I'm not a very good disciplinarian. So do we still have, you got another dog this week, and normally we've seen some kittens come through, right. but we still have a dog, so what does that mean? Yes, yeah, so we still have very few cats. I think we had two new kittens come up for adoption today, already got adopted. So again, which is nice, low on cats. But we do have lots of dogs coming in. So we continue to feature dogs. The Name Your Price Dog Adoption Special continues. So Chaz is as low as $20 to adopt. Very good. Yeah. So besides that, you have the return of food trucks soon, don't yes. you, at Helping Hands? When yes. is that coming back? So we're very excited. Um, tomorrow is our donation drive through baby shower. So oh, I don't yes, want to forget to mention that. 1 to 4 p.m., drive into our parking lot, get refreshments, drop off donations. We would love that. And next Saturday is our first food truck night of the season. So let's back up to the baby shower. Yes. What sorts of things, when you talk about baby shower, what are you looking for? What are your wants and needs? And what should people bring to you? Right. So this is a puppy and kitten baby shower. We have wish lists posted on Facebook and our website. But the main things are kitten milk replacer powder, which you can buy at a few stores in town. Um, there's a second step for kittens. There is Espelac for puppies is the same kind of powder and a second step for them. Those are really great, but also kitchen scales for weighing ne neonatal kittens or really tiny puppies and heating pads for pets. Oh. Those are our top items. Do you have the whole wish list posted on WIBW.com? I'm not on WIBW. <laughs> I was like, H -H -H well, we could. Topeka yes, we do have it on our website and I will and put the Facebook. link on WIBW.com as well because you always need those things as we get into spring. That means it's going to be a pretty busy season, especially for kittens yes. and puppies. So we want those to be in your hands yeah. as soon as we can. Go see Chaz. Chaz needs to be adopted. Yeah. He would be really lovely for your home. He's just super curious about everything <laughs> and doesn't even jump on the couch. Yeah. Thanks for bringing him in, Emmy. And thank you for being with us today for Eye on Northeast Kansas. Stay tuned for Eye Crime. We're back in a half hour with our hour of news from five to six before we head back to NCAA basketball.